When working with the M.A. Dewey system, the advantages are evident from the foundations. In fact, independently of the type of foundation used, curbs, beams or decking, this can be sized in a reduced manner by virtue of the even distribution of the loads and of its greater lightness. The reduction of costs that all this entails is thereby evident. 30 to 40 cm high rebars with a diameter of 6 mm come out of the foundations so as to allow the insertion and the anchorage of the structural panels. In the case of double panels, a connecting reinforcement is then inserted in order to obtain an integral hole. The following phase consists of assembling, aligning and plumbing the panels at the base of the building. The operation can be carried out with apposite adjustable metal supports and with aluminium bars or even with traditional building site material such as wooden boards, square timbers or any other available material. To ensure static continuity to the structure, the panels are tied up to each other and connected to the rebars. This operation can be carried out by using suitable equipment or more simply with conventional site tools such as pliers and pincers. All structural connections such as corners and joints and all the most stressed parts are reinforced with suitable portions of galvanized and electro-welded mesh for a better continuity among the walls. In areas with an elevated seismic risk or for specific structural problems, it is possible to add internal reinforcements. The intrados is internally reinforced in order to contain the concrete casting by positioning the reinforced cement in or to build or not an eventual housing for a roller bin. In case of double panel, concrete casting is carried out in a traditional manner. With the M.A. Dewey system, casting can be carried out even with unfavorable weather conditions. Moreover, the high insulating features of the panels allow a much more rapid setting of the concrete. The positioning of the floors with the M.A. Dewey system is enormously simplified thanks to the proven lightness and handiness of the panels. Structures such as balconies, cornices and the like are made by positioning the floors compatibly with their frame and span, with an obvious saving in time and a greater structural homogeneity. The placement of orthogonal walls, floor slabs and anything else to be anchored to the bearing panel can be carried out at any point, by leaving out some rebars or by adding them at any time. The placement of the panel for the stairs is very simple. As in the case of foundations, it is necessary to prepare some rebars, which in any case can be placed or added later on. Composed of landings and flights, the staircase panel is supplied ready for cladding and does not require further interventions for the creation of steps. Its solidity is assured by the reinforcement cast on site, further to its own galvanized steel mesh covering. The constructive speed of the system and its clean work are valued to the utmost in the installation of the various system, plumbing, heating, electric, etc. The chases are carried out with a simple jet of hot air. At this point, connecting the prearranged piping becomes an extremely simple operation, without the need for demolitions and restorations. Cutting eventual portions of mesh allows placement and housing of system parts of any size. The installation of shunt boxes for telephone or electrical systems and the passing, fixing and housing of cables or pipes are carried out rapidly. Internal and external rendering in this case is the traditional finishing element. Normally there is a first coat to cover the mesh and a second hand coat for leveling and finishing. The various phases must be carried out using good quality material and respecting setting times. Floor positioning can be carried out either for inter-storey solutions and for roofing. 
Roofing can be carried out at any degree of slope, shape or geometric composition with flat, curved or composite surfaces. Typical evenness and functional or static continuity of the MEDUI system are always secured. The water drainage system, the waterproof coating and the covering coating, if foreseen, are applied on the roof. The building is now ready to be finished and completed with the installation of internal and external frames, floors, furnishings and sanitary ware, and finally to be painted.